There are a number of issues and challenges facing financial services and they all existed before the vote to leave the EU and if anything Brexit compounds and accelerates those. Since 2008 and the financial crash there's been a big issue around public trust in financial services. That in turn has led to increased regulation and an increased compliance culture in financial services. At the same time there's been a technological revolution which is still underway that's transforming how consumers work with financial services. It will lead to quite significant job losses as we have robot uh, advisors, artificial intelligence. Uh, it will change the way in which regulation needs to work. And in all of that, uh, the established banks are dealing with legacy IT systems, uh, which impacts on their agility and resilience and throws up issues like cybersecurity. We're seeing a shift from, uh, from London and from Europe to Asia as financial services track across to growing middle class uh, consumers. The UK is the fintech capital of the world at the moment. I think a priority for Brexit negotiations is maintaining that, enabling that innovation to drive purpose, to change culture, to create new consum consumer services. We know banks are keen to focus on that. They need a bit of space uh, to do so and encouragement and incentivisation. Crucially for the regulator to build on the work that, for example, the FCA is already doing around regulatory technology and innovation. Thank you.